Hey, what's up? I'm Bryce Hall. I'm Anthony Reeves. I'm Jaden Hosler. I'm Josh Richards. And I'm Griffin Johnson. And, and we're, we're Sway LA. Sway LA, baby. <laughs> Come on. And we just hit an amazing interview on the Zach Sang Show. Uh, we talked about what's going to be in the future for Sway LA. Yes, and, sir. Uh, we're going to be taking over, so. Yeah, Get absolutely. Ready. Yeah, yeah, see. see ya. Hmm. Let's do this. Zach Sang Show. Zach Sang Show. Hello, beautiful human. We got Sanchez here. We got Dan here, and we welcome to the studio, Sway LA. Hey, 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 that's us. Sway is us. We are Sway. Yep. Yeah. What does Sway mean in the sense of all of you together? Like, can you what, like how did that? Why Sway? It, I I believe it was because Sway is a synonym for like clout, right? Yeah, uh, like, sure. Yes. So it's guys, like that sounds very conceited, but true. Yeah. Um, uh, <laughs> sway. Uh, yeah. So sway. We sway also only clout. had one day to come up with a name. That's also yeah. true. We needed a name for our YouTube channel. So yeah. and our house. And it's kind of close to swag. <laughs> you know that's that? not the reason. I promise you, that's not the reason. <laughs> yeah. That's the name. No, no, he's lying. <laughs> well, a part of me thought like maybe we're trying to rebrand swag. Yeah, and making right. it sway. So instead yeah. of people saying that's swag, that's sway. That's Sway. Exactly. Right. It right. sounds better, too. Yeah, what sure. do you think We could it? do that. I, That's... I, I'm here for Sway. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So will you help us turn it into a thing? I mean, maybe. Like, you know, let me let me sit with it organically. Let let it kind of, like, become one with my being. If mm, I start yeah. working into <laughs> casual conversation, uh, yeah. then we got a, something organic here. That's yeah. right. I like it. You That's feel like it? Yeah, That's Sway. Yeah. That's Sway. Yeah, glasses yeah. with no lenses. That's for sure. That's Sway. Sway. Can we also acknowledge that there's five guys squeezed on this little yeah, couch? what is it? Uh, um, we like being very close to each other. Yeah. So. Yeah. We're a family. We are a family of guys. But you only had one day to name your family YouTube channel? Yeah. It, I think it was because we had an article coming we, yeah, out. We had yeah, we had an article. Yeah. Was it in the New, New York? York? Yeah, New, New York, York Times. Times. Yeah, like so. you guys are acting like you didn't know the New York Times. It was like the it was New York Times. Times. I didn't know which one it was. The New York That's Times wrong. is a paper of record. Yeah. It is as the mo it's the most official form of historical documentation to ever exist. Yeah, I know. And, they and just Sway's didn't in it, it. so yeah. that's pretty crazy. Ooh. Sway, Sway. That's, that's a why. word. We actually had an article coming. We had one. I think it was like actually twelve hours to come up with a name. So, <laughs> how do you get an article written about yourselves without even without a name? Because <laughs> we were an established we were an established group already. Like everyone knew we associated with each other, but we didn't have like an actual name. They just called to us. The boys. The boys. No, they yeah. called us the. They called even me, even though I didn't go on the tour. The light out, but light, lights, lights out, out, lights out. We lights did out, go boys. on a tour. Yes. 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 So okay, okay. So, lights out tour, <laughs> them boys. The beginning <laughs> phases of what is now Sway LA. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. not much better, but um, yeah, it's, so it's, much better. It is yeah. way better. But way do better. you genuinely all start as friends? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. 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 Well, well I mean. We, we got went on tour together. Yeah, all of so, us to except for Bryce, because Bryce was a musically guy. Shout out musically. Cool. Um, musically. <laughs> we YouTuber. Got back I'm a YouTuber. We got yeah. YouTube, YouTuber. I'm a YouTuber. Wait, so you're yeah. on tour singing? No. no. We, so we did like. Well, you dance on tours. stage and. Sh yeah. 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 Like, no. Uh, yeah. Not even really. We would just uh, stand there for a, a good bit of time Run during the day. And uh, <laughs> many people would pay so money bad. to come and like hug and us, hug us and take pictures. And take pictures, yeah. And then we meet them, say what's up. That's bad. It, it, it was, a, a, yeah. it, it it was not a, to be rude, but why? No, I completely understand yeah, your question. Yeah. Do you yeah. see their faces? Come on. No, <laughs> you guys are beauties. Aww. And by the <laughs> way, like that meet and greet is pure joy, but right. yeah. I, it was so fun. I experienced like one of the first waves of live events related to YouTube fame. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Have you ever heard of the, the group the Janoskians? Or are you guys too young? Are they uh they're like extreme sports type? People. They no, they f around out of Australia. <laughs> they were like jackass oh, yeah, like, kids. Oh yeah, and they do like cliff diving and stuff, right? No. Okay. Then My okay. God, you got yeah, how old are close. you, Bryce? Twenty. Yeah. Oh, like you're yeah, you're so young. What do you mean that's so well, young? I'm, I'm, <laughs> turning, <laughs> I'm, turning, I'm, I'm turning twenty-one this year. I can finally drink for, for the, the first, first time, time ever. That's crazy. Yeah, first crazy. Time ever. <laughs> yeah, no, it's first time. It's gonna be insane. Bryce was like the guy. He's like he had no idea what you were actually talking about, but he already said yeah. So he's waiting for you to say what they do, and he's like. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. that name sounds familiar. I've yeah, because been on you might you might know them because they did Jackass style videos and they went on tour and they did like they took the meet and greet up, greet up a notch and they did like stupid games and like they did like skits or oh, whatever. That's cool though. So 
Yeah, we me, did not do that. That's yeah, more. Actually, <laughs> yeah. no, no, we are. We, we are did the dating game. game. Remember? Guys? Yeah, we did do the dating uh, game. Yeah, no, that yeah. that is very bad, and I don't want to ever see that again. But nope. we are doing a tour that, was so uh, that we're we're thinking of soon, and it's gonna be ten times better in the future. Yeah, it's like, gonna be fantastic. Actually, no, that's an understatement. A hundred times better. That was yes. their tour was complete trash. I'm sorry. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Got it. Got it. It wasn't our tour. We were just on it. Yeah, I know. We did our best, really, man. I smiled as hard as I could. We smiled. So it's gonna be hard to top the next tour, but um, eight hours of standing it. actually. Yeah, it's it's crazy. Crazy. really hurts the glutes. <laughs> Honesty is the best policy. Let's get back on track here. So you are all friends. Who n recognizes that there is something here or potential to create content and make this into a legitimate entity? Like, who kind of recognized that? I think um, all of us. It was like a team effort, but really, yeah. Josh came together with a couple of like executives that we knew and really made it into something like feasible you know what I'm saying? right well i went to bryce's house after tour this summer and we all kind of started talking and i met uh, michael gruen which you know um but we we all kind of just got into this conversation about we felt that social media kids were getting taken advantage of in the space and that there was no one looking out for them or uh giving them the team around them that they need so we thought why don't we do that mm -hmm. and you've done that Correct. Like, yes. In more ways than just Sway LA. Yeah. Yes. Right. But so let's talk about you, Josh Richards. You're born in Canada. Correct. You were like an actor. Um, yeah. So I did some acting last summer. I was in uh, two independent films and now I'm more focusing on the entrepreneurial side of social media. So when you say entrepreneurial side, does that relate to the creation of content or just how content is distributed and then monetized? I mean, it's more like I, I create my own content. Like I'm a content creator and I create content with these guys. So there's that part to it. And then there's also the signing of new talent and recruitment and touring, all that. That's more of the business side to it. What do you enjoy? I, I like both. I mean, I fell in love with social media because I was able to express myself and um, just make videos that I thought were fun with my friends, which I've always loved doing since I was a kid. So I thought, I'm going to do this. I'm going to be the best at it. And that's what I'm trying to do. And then I also have loved business my whole life. And I've had uh, like three little businesses when I was a kid that had to do with sports. And I sold like uh, merchandise and stuff like that. So it was just going back into the business world again that I love as well. Any nerves forming a supergroup type situation here when the reality is like you've watched YouTube versions of this come and sometimes crash and burn, sometimes succeed for a little bit and then crash and burn? Yes. Yeah. I would uh, say there's I've seen some. every I don't think any group has lasted more, more than more than like 2 3 years. Yeah. Yeah. Right. But we plan to exceed that. Yeah. I kind of like them a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> we really we, we've grown friends. a little fond of each I other think, so. I think kind of what puts us aside I know there's probably been groups before, like, we've been friends forever, like, I don't think we've ever had a fight or anything crazy like that. Um, also, I think uh, behind us, we have, a, like, a great team. Mm -hmm. um, our staff is insane. We have some Very of the best true. people from all kinds of different agencies that have been in the game forever, and we kind of um, picked out some of their um, best workers, and we have, like, a really good group behind us, and I think that kind of sets us apart from... The groups in the past, social media wasn't as big. And I think we're kind of forming that and showing um, what you can actually do with social media and like forming like equity and stuff like that. But what can you do with social media? Oh, man. Hmm. What, anything. And, and exactly. I, don't, I don't mean to say that in a general sense. Like, what are you doing with social media that people before haven't been able to do? Well, social media adapts like every single year. Like, yeah, it changes there's, there's, constantly. Yeah, there's not like yesterday already been a huge change it's like there's different generations it's like the musically kids which i was on there was the live streamers the the youtubers the tiktokers that's this generation and i guess we're waiting for the next generation yeah and it's huge though like tiktok is so big like, it's, it's insane it's the biggest out of all the generations that i've been through what makes it big the amount of users on it yeah but what <laughs> thank you <laughs> <laughs> why are people seeking tiktok out as a platform of choice well tiktok is made with the intention to give every single person every single creator every single account the ability to have a viral video just as much as we would it's equal. say with millions yeah. of followers yeah. the algorithm the for is you based off of that and so with that much attraction it's created like its own society to where it's that society has made such a noise in like the real world and like 
uh, that even celebrities and stars are getting on it. So now it's become like a mandatory thing. It's the new Vine. It's the new Instagram. Totally. But multiplied by 10 or 100 or anything. You know what I mean? It's just, it doesn't stop growing. But is it, it scary knowing that the next you could literally be anywhere because the algorithm favors no one? Uh, that is, that is, you have scary. to take it yeah. into account though. You have I to think it's it part of, it's part of like, it's what separates like the biggest creators from those creators that last like one month. It's, it's like the ones that are really big and they stay big. It's because they found a way to realize how do I stay on top of the algorithm? How am I the one that's showing up in the for you page all the time? Or how do I make this Instagram picture perform better than the next one? Instead of just, Oh, I'm going to go on with my daily life and just post and uh, maybe it'll do good. Maybe it won't. But is that a science? Can you break that down to like, I believe if you do this, this, and this in a photo, it's going to get more likes than the last one. I mean, I in would say in a way. Yeah. yeah, yeah, absolutely. So what's like the perfect f set of ingredients <laughs> for the perfect <laughs> Having TikTok. a girlfriend. On Having TikTok. a girlfriend. <laughs> By the way, you all are in relationships, correct? <laughs> Not, me. Not me. Um, I think it's us yeah, in the middle. Yeah, in the middle. Yeah. Oh. yeah. The two single ones are... On the outside. Okay, Makes sense. So are you, are you seeing a downward spiral, a downtrend in your <laughs> statistics now that you're single? No. I think they're just, I mean, I did have like kind of like a little fling. What happened with Addison? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah that, we that's the that. name of that person. Um, <laughs> Ouch. Yes. No, I mean, we're good. We're still chilling. Mm -hmm. she, <laughs> came, she came by the house one, Put my heart one time. In after. the bag. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, uh, yeah, I did have that relationship. We we were like kind of killing the internet. Like everyone was like, "Are they dating? Are they not?" I think we dated for actually only three days. Like actually, boyfriend Hard. and girlfriend, and then Hard. that's cool. Yeah, that's like the longest nope. relationship I've ever been in. So then, what is your relationship? <laughs> <laughs> three days. Yeah, that's a long one. Baby yeah. steps. I'm proud of you. What is the relationship? Co-content uh, creators just looking to create content together. That's kind of what we were doing, and and uh, we never yeah. addressed that we were were dating. So it's like everybody was like, "Oh my god, just tell us." Yeah, speculation's hot. Yeah, so yeah. you're you're just like working and hooking yeah. up. Yeah, we kind of just milked it a little. Josh, bit. speak upon his words. I just think part of that is definitely cap. Um, what I do think, you mean? I think <laughs> it was a little bit more than just content relationship oh yeah you want to you want to get into this how long have you been dating your girlfriend four months exactly and you kept her a secret for three i did I, I <laughs> but did. that's how you know the relationship is true exactly, exactly. and we I were had to a make secret sure, too. i had to make sure she wasn't just about the followers nobody know? nobody okay. knew how for the know? three days that we were dating that we were actually dating wow so 72 hours that's we basically strong. are on the same level really we are. three days three months same exact thing. same experience exact same. And it's crazy. By the way, so, like, you did that strategically, right? Because you 100%. wanted to know if this girl was legitimate. Yeah. Well, it's like I cared about her and I just wanted to make sure that she cared about me. Where in Canada are you from? I'm from Toronto. Cool. Yeah. I like yeah, Toronto. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. We like Canada, right, Daniel? Love Canada. Great national anthem. Great national anthem. One of the anthem. best I'd say. Can you, can you sing it? <clears throat> yeah, do you I mean, it? I'm probably not going to sing it, but. Uh, why? <laughs> do your country proud. What's your problem? Yeah, yeah it's kind of messed you up. Wanna, you You're in a room of Americans. I'll sing with you. You will? Yep. All right, let's Go. hit it. One, three, two, two, three. One. Oh, Canada, our home and native land. Free health care. That's all I know. <laughs> yeah, okay, we'll cut it off there. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was good, though. We need to Thank add ad-libs next time. <laughs> yes. yeah. Jane, we need to add ad-libs. Yeah. Okay. Can, can, can you, you run it again? Actually? We can yeah. do it again if you yeah, want. Yeah, run it back. Yeah, ad-libs. You got all right. Okay. Yeah. Count us down. Mm. Uh, three. Three, two, two one. Oh, Canada. Canada. Yeah. Our home and yeah. native yeah. land. Land, land, hey. land. True. True. Yeah. 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 Okay. No taxes. <laughs> Drake yeah, just cried for some reason and he doesn't know why. It's because this is happening. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, 100%. Somewhere tears are just streaming down Drake's face. <laughs> All over the place. That's actually hilarious. <laughs> um... Wow, we have a lot to get to here. We're not even halfway through. Oh, yeah, we need to stop talking. Well, Bryce, <laughs> you fought somebody. Oh, no. yes. Oh, no. Bryce. You, you fought bad Zach. And the first thing that came oh, to mind... a long oh. time ago. <laughs> I don't think it was going to be that yeah, long. Yeah, yeah, long time ago. My date says 2018. Like, what, where are you at? It's 2020. Oh, I know. New yeah. decade, new new beginnings. Yeah, exactly. Um, But the <laughs> truth is... <laughs> do you fought somebody else? Uh, no, I was kidding. Oh. Is this like a real fight? I don't fight? think you're kidding. Not you're not kidding either. at all. He's not kidding. It it's, like a con it's, it's not like I'm intending to fight. It's like... What? 
it happens. <laughs> and then, you know, it's like, it's like, oh, it gets blown way out of proportion because there's multiple sides to every story. And then even when people aren't involved in it, they get involved and then they just and blown out of proportion even more. <laughs> and then it good. just gets terrible. That was you know, that and, you know, usually the person that, like, fights more is the one that's blamed. So, yeah, my bad again. Love you, Zach. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. You know what I got out of that? You're a fighting pigeon, yeah, pigeon. <laughs> who also has a crucifix tattooed to its ear. <laughs> I, this is. Do you fight with that crucifix on your ear? N- no, I usually have a burrito in my ear. <laughs> this is actually <laughs> my, a burrito. Yeah, this is actually his earring. You're known for your earring. Do you like that or hate that? Um, I I usually have really crazy stuff in my ear, so yeah, I like that. It's a good branding point. Yeah, it is. I want yeah. people to look at my ears. Yeah. <laughs> it's a weird thing because your ears are ugly yeah. as. Sh- <laughs> yeah. You look like Ken Barbie. Uh, How much time do you spend looking at his ears? As a man a who makes money a lot, he does. probably a lot. Probably like twenty five percent of my day. I mean, Josh, think about it. Like, you now have a stake in this company that's endorsing this guy, and he does an ear endorsement, an earring right. endorsement, a Claire's trip. Exactly. You know what are you gonna sell yeah. an wow. ugly right. ear? So Eat maybe it. I need to up it to like thirty five percent from twenty five. I think that's Eat fair. It. Okay. So. What you're gonna eat his ear? No, I'm saying he needs to eat mine. Oh my god, ears. Anyways, what are next you question, next please. <laughs> New meaning to cauliflower. <laughs> next topic. Uh, I want to talk about cautionary tales. Like, what do you learn from watching a group like Team Ten that you take with you in starting this journey? I would say, like, don't hook up with people in your house. Yeah. <laughs> like, like honestly, though. Honestly, though like, I mean, uh, we're safe because we're a group of Josh, I'm not into you like that. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> but it's like, it's like what, uh, one of the big faults was like, they had relations inside the house with people living there. So when it went wrong, everything blew up. Is That's that true. one of the reasons why you guys have been considering, but don't think you'll be adding any females to the house? Yes. Correct. Yeah. 100% correct. Mm. <laughs> Are there female TikTok houses? I no. think that's what, like, they need to start one. Yeah. Right. There is no And, like, we have like females those. signed to Talent X, so it's, like, they're signed to the company, and we collab with a lot of the girls that are also uh, signed, but yeah. it's just, like, we don't have them live with us. In the house. Yeah. 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 It's just safer that way. Yeah. None of you have the strength to exist with a female in your zone? I can't. I can't. <laughs> I mean, I'll start shaking. <laughs> <laughs> Another trend that's woven its way through your content is you guys make a lot of jokes about kissing each other <laughs> <laughs> I, we, I think we've already made like six since on, we sat on down the, on this yeah on this i said we like dish. we like sitting this close yeah no we make lots of jokes about that because you got to kiss the homies you know yeah yeah <laughs> i don't know i don't kiss any of my homies yeah, I don't uh, we, then they're probably i, I don't either yeah, <laughs> besides <laughs> bryce's uh instagram picture on new year's yeah that's it Wow, and I've not kissed up. a single one of my homies. So. Yeah, Anthony, actually, I'm in the yeah. Anthony's <laughs> the only scared one, actually. Why yep. is that? I'm scared. I don't know. Give somebody a kiss. I Just kiss me, dude. I. Oh, oh I'll take that. that was nice. Wow, yes. that was cute. What, are you looking for cheek action? <laughs> I, was, I was, I was expecting a lip. Actually. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's scared. It's okay. That. Yeah. So we just joke about kissing each other. Yeah, it's not we, yeah. J- well, it's kind of half jokes. <laughs> <laughs> no offense. Yeah. I mean, there shouldn't be any offense taken. Jokes yeah, a lot of yeah, times no. come from truth. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Right. I, I think mean, it started yeah. with Jaden and Bryce's little like love tension they had. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's st- it's still there. It's, it's still, still there. It's just like yeah, the way he just looked at him. I, he said the way he just looked at him. Uh, no, I moved in with Bryce and Taylor, um, another roommate that we used to have first, like before we moved in, all moved in together. So me and Bryce have been uh, hanging out every day for a while now. So it's not, yeah. it's just like the weirdness left like the second week I hung out with them. So it's like, you know, why not? Yeah. Who cares? Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? You have Chanel in your ear. He has a crucifix in his. I do. Do you like it though? That's the thing. Oh, I do like it a lot. Thank you. Yeah, it's very nice. I appreciate that. Good looks. You have a creative director. His name is Nick Bean. <laughs> yes. yes. Bean. Love him. What, what does a creative director do for you guys? <laughs> Pop out your lenses of your glasses? <laughs> yeah, yes. that was him. That Essentially, was like, yes. Get out of here. You need these gone. I mean, he helps <laughs> with a lot of YouTube video yeah. ideas. It's so this is like a multi-platform thing here, yeah. obviously. Yeah. Yeah. YouTube, TikTok, and he's actually creating content with uh, you? Yeah, he creates content. He actually he actually created a few viral songs. Yeah. Like, yeah. they're they're like, you know, kid songs, but Insert they're pretty viral. <laughs> Yeah, they, yeah, maybe they, you've heard Chicken Nugget. Chicken Nugget yeah. has over 100 million views. If you like Chicken Nuggets, then you gotta sing along. Wait, if you like Chicken Nuggets, then it's your favorite song. Why isn't he here chicken, performing chicken this nugget. anthem? For <laughs> I know. That's why. <laughs> he, 
flu. He's sick. He has the yeah, flu. flu. My God. He's a prolific man. Why is he giving you all his talent? Exactly. Exactly, exactly, yes. We lucked out. Like we said, best team around us. <laughs> so what type of content are you guys creating? Like, what? what's your... Like, say uh, you're creatively dry on a random Tuesday. Is there, like, a go-to format of a TikTok? Different. Yeah, so on we're YouTube, YouTube, I do a lot of college stuff. Like, like what? Parties. Mm. You go to the parties? Yeah. Yeah. He's a, yeah. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> and I film it. What, you, you, you go crazy. I do a lot of interviews, too, like, on, on uh, college campuses. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, they actually are really fun. We just did one yesterday, actually. Yeah, for my yeah. channel. So that'll be cool. So you're cross collaborating content, but you all have your own beats. So let's yeah. go down the couch here and like, you're doing interviews and filming parties. I'm more fashion based and do that kind of stuff. Very nice. Uh, I'm on in the process of breaking into music, so that's really cool. You have, he's like eating the mic. Sorry. Yeah, well, so you're not supposed to do that. Uh, <laughs> my name is Jaden. <laughs> yeah. I guess for me, it's like I would kind of. As of right now, just establish my content as messing around with my friends. Like it's it's nothing else than that. And for YouTube, it's kind of still finding my identity because I just started YouTube three four weeks ago. Totally different platforms. Totally different. It's more long form content than it yeah. is short form. And I mean, for the last three and a half years, all I've been doing is short form content. So it's really cool to like branch off into something different. But it's gonna like probably take. A few months to figure out what I want to do. Totally. It's stressful, too. You have mm-hmm. endless amounts of time. You have no yeah. restraints. Yeah, and editing is where it's... Oh, dude. I'm mentally exhausted from editing. Uh, yeah. It's just up till 4 a.m., wake up at 7 so we can edit more and then have the video out. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> What's your beat? Um, So I started... I'm doing, like, reaction slash, like, roasting. Um, you make fun of people? He makes fun of so many it's people. It's not yeah. like you, have to you be are careful. such a douche. No, you yeah. have to be careful with how you do it. It's not like roasting like someone by their appearance or something. It's more like like the content itself and how it's like formatted and the layout of it. And it's kind of, it's kind um, of funny because he roasts people's content when his content is I ro- I've roasted myself <laughs> too. So to yeah. be fair, yeah. I've roasted all of us <laughs> and myself. It's kind of contradicting. Um, but I do a lot of videos with Bryce and the whole like like wild and out scene uh so i kind of use his channel to express my personality and then on mine i just like it kind of like is forming in to go like hand in hand with his content yeah so like on my channel he shows how crazy and wild he is and then on his channel he shows how mean and annoying he is so it's like it's it's you sound sound like a guy i really want to hang with (laughs) okay all right yeah roast me (laughs) <laughs> roast them, come on. By the way, know something. Roast comics get like grilled. I was once in an elevator with uh I think his name is Jeff. What's his name? The bald guy? Ross. Jeff, Jeff Ross. Ross. Dude, and this person in the elevator was like, "Make fun of me. Make fun of me." <laughs> he did. Make fun of me. <laughs> so do it on the he spot. Said, come on. I can't. You know, he, he, he writes down his stuff first. Yeah, he's no he's no Jeff Ross, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. I just I don't In the making. I feel like yeah. this is the first time we've met. And then, like, I, I might have to see you again. So then, like, if I roasted you, then it might be a little awkward next time. It's a Just process. do it. He's giving you permission, though. Yeah. Oh, you don't want your first impression to be roasting me? Yeah, exactly. Also, I don't, I haven't met you and known enough about you yet. I literally uh, looked at you for three and a half seconds and made fun of your ridiculous glasses. <laughs> that like, they're not glasses. You roasted you. No, no, no. They're not you glasses. You have to roast him back. They're <laughs> iron or like some sort that's of crappy hilarious. metal that's put together. Yes. So Glasses have lenses. Just to speak on this, glasses. since you mentioned it, um, the glasses are actually sunglasses. <laughs> that you I told me the lenses. same story. <laughs> but Gri- Griffin, now. he's giving you permission to roast him. The reason you, I do he it roasted is obliterated you. you. <laughs> he obliterated you. You're just, disintegrated. Just it's my, I get it. You're nervous. It's my domain. No, the reason I wanted to. Uh, <laughs> we get it. You're scared. The reason that was I the keep wearing them. I've ever heard in my life, by the way. Let yeah, me explain the glasses. Cool guys. Yeah, cool guys. Yeah, keep talking to you. All right. Um, <laughs> anyways, the reason I wear these is because. People ask me about them, yeah, and yeah. then it gets like more attention. Mm. Right. Conversation starter. Exactly. They're like, "Are those real?" I'm like, "Yeah." <laughs> it's, just it's mostly like, "Why do you have those stupid fucking glasses on?" <laughs> and then, and then Griffin's like, "Oh, I just, I just wear them because they're actually like, sunglasses." Their style. <laughs> I, th- I think I, I'm just. I think it's funny. I think it's funny that he wears fake glasses. Where in Illinois are you from? Paris. Paris, Illinois. Yes. Wow, the most famous Paris in the world, I believe. I, I actually, that. yeah. I, I just tell people I'm from Paris, and they're like, do you speak French? And then you say we. 
we. Oui. Yes. I love Illinois a lot. Um, how did you, how did you meet everybody? Was it through the fact that you were a part of like a frat at a, Illinois State, or was it just through TikTok? Like, how did you join them? Um, so <laughs> it's funny. This girl actually posted a video of me on TikTok of me in class, and she's like, like day one until my crush falls in love with me, and it blew up. So then I was like, hey. I guess I'll hop on the wave. Wow. And your ego has never been the same again. <laughs> yeah, he's all the way up here. He's been a guy that doesn't wear lenses. Yeah. How does that make you feel when you when you find out that somebody TikToked you in private? Because you didn't know you were being TikToked? No. Invasion of privacy? Or are you just like, this is my moment? This, I mean, this came to me and knocked on my advantage door. Of she that changed my executed. life. So, I mean, thank you. Do you know Alyssa. her name? Shout her name. Alyssa. I said thank you, Alyssa. Have you oh, talked dope. to Alyssa since? No, I actually don't. Still don't know her. Oh. But shout out Alyssa. <laughs> <laughs> so clearly All you wanted was a date. You couldn't just give her that after yeah. making it famous? Wow. You know how viral that would have went if you I never went on a saw date her with her? Well, <laughs> well, we got to find her. Yeah. Find the girl who did this to all of you. <laughs> that's actually okay. hilarious. That'd be funny. Yeah, that's that should be a date. And you, she, I mean, it's the least you could do. Yeah. She started Fact. your whole career. All right, so. you guys made me feel terrible about myself. <laughs> she got you rich and famous, yeah. so you need to. Well, famous. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 True. Good. Jeez, Jeez, bro. Nice. What are your content goals for the next year? Like, where do you see content going? Taking over YouTube, hundred percent. That's, that, that's not the question. No, he said, "Where do you see your content going?" All on YouTube. <laughs> okay, okay, that is true. We're we're gonna transfer over from TikTok as our main platform to YouTube, at least most of us. And to be honest, I think we're gonna take over. I actually no, I don't think I know we're gonna yeah. we're gonna cause a dent on YouTube. It's got, sure. everyone's gonna be like, why are these kids on YouTube? And we're gonna be like, <laughs> kind of like twenty, kind of wow. like twenty sixteen Jake Paul vibes. Everyone hated him, but like he caused a dent. Yeah, it's kind of like that. Yeah. What's the plan to cause a dent? What is the strategy? You can't reveal that on camera. Like, yeah. Teach us something because we've been doing okay. this for too long and nobody gives two craps about us on the internet. Yeah. You just have to be crazy outgoing and uh, to not, I don't know if you're allowed to cuss on here, but to not give a f about anything. Hmm. It's like about wild energy. I didn't have a Red Bull today, true. so you can't see my wild energy, but I'm usually like like shaking and stuff. Season. Yeah, I also <laughs> think confidence is a, like a key aspect in a lot of creators that really like gravitates a lot of fans towards them because the people want what they can't have and a lot of people don't have confidence and they're very insecure so like if you can try, kind of portray that people love that and they it goes out to the it. viewers be confident baby girl yeah be yes yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey. and if it's a boy be confident, be confident baby boy <laughs> <laughs> be confident confidence is a big part of it mm -hmm. i understand that mm -hmm. have you tried to figure out the formula to what made logan paul successful what made any of these people work? Uh, me personally, I studied a lot of like big influencers content. Like I just saw what they did and I was like, all right, how do I turn that into my own thing? So like Bryce said, like everyone that was big, Jake Paul, Logan Paul, Dolan Twins, they all have a huge energy. Like they're just outgoing, screaming, yelling on camera, being as hype as they can be. And people just all attach that right away. Because they want their lives to be like that. They want to be like that. So if you're able to kind of show them almost like their own dream life or like show them like a crazy life, they want to be a part of it and yeah. go on that journey with you. Is this a forever thing? I, I think what? it's forever. Mm, so. Good answer. Yeah. That it's was like, a good answer. I think it's, it's like this <laughs> leads on to the next thing and then the next thing leads on to the next thing. It's, it's a stepping stone. Exactly. It's a day by I think day, all really. this type of stuff is just about like letting doors open in front of you and then like choosing which doors to go into. Capitalizing on them. Capitalize on it and working hard. I mean, you can get lazy in LA and nothing will happen for three years, but you could use that same energy and put it in to like three months and get something out of it. You know what I mean? It's really easy to get lazy and get comfortable. Very true. Oh, yeah. Very yeah. true. Very, and you have yeah. big fancy mansions around you. and Parties yeah. every night. Like, Parties. Yeah, you, can, you can fall are, into uh, a You deep get hole caught really in the party quick. scene. Ooh. Yeah. That's not good. Yeah. Definitely. That's how most people fall off. That you is guys, true. Are you guys partying a lot? Not so much. No, nah, none of us party. Yeah. Not really. I, like, I party a lot. Were you just saying your videos <laughs> yeah. are you going to yeah, college no, campuses and I'll going just, to parties? Yeah, yeah no, I, I, I do. I do party a little it's bit. It's not like I'm actually day, on a though. cleanse right now. Like yeah. full on just everything cleanse. A party cleanse? Well, no. 
<laughs> but like drinking and stuff. Yes, but you yeah. don't do that because you're on uh, your I know, I know. I'm saying, like, I, that's why I'm on a cleanse until it's my 21st It's been a 21-year cleanse. Yeah, it's been like, <laughs> yeah, he's almost there, so yeah, yeah. he's really excited about it. How many more months it. is it till you're 21? Uh, seven. Oh, six. perfect. So you're almost there. That's yeah. crazy. Um, six months. So. Ooh, how are you going to celebrate? Uh, None of your friends are going to be able to go. <laughs> yeah. Well, we Griffin can. Can. You. Griffin can. Yeah, yeah that's true. Griffin. Hey. Yeah, I have, like, this this thing. I want to I wanna spend $21,000 on my 21st birthday for a party. Like, a $21,000 budget on a party. Wow. Or, mm. That's a lot of money. Yeah, but for a party though, and you only turn twenty-one one time, so it's like it's true. Yeah. Every year, you same with turn every like age. age. That is true though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Jaden, oh. yes. You want to do music? I do. I'm doing music actually. Eleven songs. <laughs> you do have. There's this comatose. Yes. You you know the name? That's awesome. Yes. <laughs> Just looking at this sheet. I, I know, mean, but hey, <laughs> he knows the name. Let a man look at look at the prep, okay? <laughs> Let a man not say comatose yeah. wrong because it's quite a name. Is it comatose or comatose? Hey, it's comatose uh, from what I know. It's okay. a synonym for numb. So, like, obviously I could have been simple and just start, used the lyric numb, but I thought comatose kind of gave it, like, a distance from people, which is the vibe I wanted. So, At what Edgy. phase in Edgy all this sure. at, at what phase in all this do you start writing this song? Oh, man. So I've done music my whole life, really, just kind of prefacing um and then i blew up uh blew up i started social media literally a year ago in february um last year so i grew from that and then we were on tour like we talked about lights out boys shout out um and we went to a juice concert and the concert yeah. actually wasn't very nice because like he didn't come on to like 10 and he was supposed to come on at like seven but i love juice world like i always have um rip juice but uh he sang the song empty and every single fucking person in that crowd while he was singing that was like had their middle fingers up and we we're just like screaming it and i was like oh my gosh this isn't just music like they actually feel this and so i just really care about people a lot and i thought like you know i love music there's nothing else i really want to do so let's just dive into it and then i started making rock music and i release on the 26th my fur my first single which is Thank really you. exciting so yeah rock music comatose yes yeah like that, that song actually that you mentioned yeah, comatose, exactly. Yeah. So, a part of all of this is just an opportunity to get out there and build yourself and be Absolutely. a vehicle for you to release your music. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I uh, I lived in Tennessee, and before that, Texas, and I just didn't really have, like, the assets or know anyone that could genuinely help me get to places. Um, so, coming out to L.A. was, like, the biggest blessing for me in so many ways. And now I'm about to, like, really just try to break into it. Because, like, as a TikToker, you know, like, people think, like, oh, he's a TikToker. He's just going to make music. So rock really settled with me, and it varies between, like, different genres, like pop rock and, like, stuff. But um, I think my music's going to be very influential in our generation. It's going to be awesome. So I'm really excited. Mm. Love it. What do you take from TikTok and understanding social media, and how do you apply that into your music? That everyone wants to feel a part of something, and I think that in social media, there is a little bit of satisfaction from that for fans between creators and um, supporters but I think music is the best way to really build like a following and a crowd where you can all kind of like chant together and like the songs are really just kind of like their anthems um, everyone just wants to feel appreciated and so that's what I want to do just with like music you know what I mean agreed absolutely date on that single one more time uh, February 26th mark your calendars mark it let's do it that's we're my mom's that birthday, birthday. Yeah, well, that's, gonna, that's gonna be a crazy uh, party yep, yep. Maybe yep. we'll be invited, Daniel. Hey, hey you guys are invited. Come. This yeah, is your personal come, invite. Yes. What time does the party start? I go to bed at like 8 p.m. <laughs> it, start, it, start, it starts at yeah. 7. We go to bed. We so were just talking. You guys, really? yes. These guys are up till like 3, 4 a.m. like every night, no matter what, even if they have nothing to do. And me and Jaden are like, 9.30? All right, it's time to go to bed. I just get tired. All right, up. just roast us. <laughs> I still wake up earlier than you. What time? All right, what time you guys get up? I wake up like seven thirty, eight o'clock every morning. Perfect. Nine. I was up before everyone. See, that's morning, just so unnecessary like to wake up, wake up that early. Why? There's I mean, a lot to the day. It's true. See, it's true. I think nine a.m. is so a perfect long. time to just be like, oh, okay, it's it's perfect time to just go work out. What now. time did you wake up today? Twelve one. I was up. Jesus. Doing something, <laughs> and I woke up at eleven. Okay, let's not mm -hmm. make it bad. It's true. So, yeah. Well, Yesterday was one or two. 
I wake up and then nine no, before that was also. <laughs> Stop trying to roast me on this. Like, I wake, wake up earlier that. than you. I literally no, wake you up. I wake you up every single day. Oh my no, God. No, no. Are you guys going to fight? Yeah. <laughs> I would Rise. love to see you fight. <laughs> Rise, cut up some slack. He's from Canada, dude. He's salty. <laughs> yeah, no, he's, he's guys, salty. how's the whole living situation? Like, Do you guys share rooms? How's this whole thing work? Um, me and Jaden share the master bedroom. And okay. then everyone else has their own room. Okay, yeah. cool. Yeah. Yeah. Do you guys have like cleaning ladies? Is the house a mess? I could just see it being disgusting. Uh, <laughs> it can get pretty messy. It, it, when we have guests over, so like, I don't know why, but everyone just feels the need to gravitate towards us and then spend the night. It's because we're fun, Bryce. Yeah. That's why. Yeah, we're part, we're but party they, they're just, they're just very, they mess up the house and they don't clean up after themselves. Mm. Yeah. And I don't really feel like That's cleaning true. other people's mess. But our rooms, personally, everybody's rooms are very clean, actually. But who cleans the house? You got a maid? Yeah. We Sometimes have, when it gets like really dirty. Or me say, and Alana. Yeah. And we don't really have Shout parties out. though at the house, so usually we can just pick it up ourselves. Yeah, but we do need to get a mop. I don't know if we have one of those yet. <laughs> a mop? Oh, no. I think mop? I bought one. Yeah, no, I think I bought one, but it disappeared. I don't think we just got a vacuum cleaner cleaned cleaned so. for real in their entire life. That's so cap. So not true. Dude, maybe you guys can make a video of yourselves cleaning your house. Yeah, that yeah. is. I would love to see that because I've never seen them clean yeah. the house. Then people would be like, "Oh, it's such a big game, bro!" But you're, I've seen them. Clean what do you mean? Friends clean that your One own time. room for you. What do you mean? Yeah. Bro, That's true. Literally, have that is true. They have girlfriends clean to clean for them. Clean what a life! They don't clean. That's <laughs> yeah, awesome. That's I'm the only <laughs> and I clean for myself. Oh. It's a that sad existence. That, that does suck. Yeah. <laughs> Anthony, do you still only have one video up on your YouTube channel? Yes. <laughs> What's we going always on? roast him about that. I don't know. I just don't know what I want to do with YouTube yet. Dude, you're up so early. You have all day to plan. I know. <laughs> I was not sure exactly what I want to do yet. Okay. Well, it out. Well, the no, video, no if you actually like watch it, he I think he's like, I what, literally, two words. I say about five words. Well, what a words legend, legend dude. Was, just what a, a minute. Legend. Sound, I think it has a million views. It's like 800k. <laughs> Insane. Wow. Just, just him staring, just at, him staring yeah, at the camera. It's pretty cool. Wow, it cinematic masterpiece. Cool. <laughs> yeah, maybe, that, that, maybe that can be your thing. Maybe. Just, just, just sit at the camera just for just don't do every minute. minutes. That's just a different five words you say. <laughs> just like they have no like, just random, 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 random no words. No correlation yeah. to yeah. anything but, about the video. No. But the truth yeah. is like you have what to collect is, all the videos and like match them all up together to figure out a large sentence. Monster X is our next guest. Is that what's happening out there? I have a question though before we take those guys on um how much do your looks have to do with like how much does that have to do with your success <laughs> a lot i actually um, uh. <laughs> i don't want to be branded as like a little pretty boy so i wear like hoodies and they're wow that's a lot of people anyways i wear like <laughs> hoodies and shorts all the time with like a like a hat over the hood just to like say like i don't care about what i look like yeah but you yeah. do i mean like, <laughs> I, do. I think that's I, Look but how much this guy dressed up for this thing. I, when do I ever dress up? All the time. I, Shut up. <laughs> I think on social media, trying to look your best is, like, never actually the issue. It's whenever you start to compare yourself to other people. And so, like, yeah, I definitely care about what I look like. Like, I want to look fly as f you know what I'm saying? I mean, his I, hair, look his hair. Weird. That's how you continue to grow because people love that type of stuff. So it, I think it has a huge factor. I was say, because TikTok, like, everybody's doing similar things. It, is it about luck? Is it about talent? Or is it really like a lot of the look has to do with the success? Mm, it's, it's luck. Kind of like look, luck, talent. talent. Yeah, yeah it's, the, it's the three L's. And yeah. personality too as well. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Personality on camera is very important. And and it can be deceiving because like off camera people can be like obviously the, the dry as hell. But mm -hmm. personality on camera, if you can master that, then it's like you'll be good, especially on TikTok. Boom. 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 Secrets drop right mic. here, man. Drop mic here. The keys to TikTok. I would drop it, but... Yeah, Secret com... Uh, you, you have a song coming. Secrets. Your song is dropping <laughs> February 26th, toward yes. this summer, possibly. Yeah. Yes. Hell yeah. YouTube channels being built. Yeah, I yes. think... I think five words. Five words. Five words. Five words being spoken. Yeah. <laughs> Very exciting for you guys. Come and hang more often. Thank you so much for having us. Thanks for having us. Thank you. Anytime, anytime. Sway LA, everybody. Sway LA. Sway. Woo. Hey, beautiful human, thanks for watching our full interview, but I get it. Like, a full interview is a lot, so we got a clips channel. We don't expect you to watch the full thing anymore, so we just gave you the highlights. Please, subscribe, and uh, notifications, and all that stuff. Okay, cool. I love you.